Good morning. Uh. 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 Oh my God! We're at my house. Why are we at my house? Uh, we came here because it was closer or something. Rich, you can't be here, my dad. Oh. oh. Rich, come on! Chris, you're going to be late. Stay behind me and be quiet. Are you come with me? No, Dad drives me every day. Fine. Mm. I'll see you in college. Shit, it's locked. There's only one other way. You'll have to go at the back through the kitchen. And Rich, I trust you, OK? OK. He's your dad. Why didn't you tell me? I'll explain later. Just don't let him see you. It's the only way out. Fucking crazy. Now go. Princess? You look a bit peaky. Actually, I'm not feeling too great. Maybe I'm sick or something. Um, Dad, don't you come over here and feel my head too? Does want to me? Are you sure you're getting enough iron in your diet? Maybe not. I... Um... Check her head again, David. Who on earth is in the garden? Back! Help me! Please get off me! Back! Oh, no. Down! Get off! Back! Fucking You remember Rich from college? Uh... Um, hi. Well, um, let's be off now. Side gate unlocked, great. See, see you later then. He seems nice. <laughs> drop-off point. Dad, I can explain. There's no need. I think our little experiment may be over. It's time you returned to Maybury's College for young ladies. No! You can't send me back there. It's in the middle of nowhere and everyone's horrible and smells of horses. This place is bad for you. These friends I see you with, they <laughs> distract you from your studies. <laughs> but you don't know me. All my friends and I get A's for everything. Everything! Grace, calm down, please. How about this? <laughs> you may live your life as you want, but the moment, the moment <laughs> you achieve a grade less than A, starting with your AS drama <laughs> examination, you will return to Maybury's College. <laughs> OK. Good. Have a productive morning. David Bloody Blood. Doesn't want people to know. Why not? He thinks it will compromise his position. People know he has a daughter in college. He made me promise. So you just did what he said and you didn't even tell me. 
He's my dad. I didn't have a choice. We're late for rehearsal. Andrew Eggy Cheek. Come on. Give me my veil. Come! Throw it over my face. <laughs> we'll once more hear Orsino's embassy. The Honourable Lady of the House. Which is she? Speak to me. OK, held it there. <laughs> We're going to skip down a few scenes and come back to you later. Minnie, sit down. Matty, we'll do Act 4, Scene 2. Thine eye hath stayed upon some favour that it loves, hath it not, boy? A little, by your favour. Remember, Frankie, you're talking about him. You're completely in love. What kind of woman is it? Of your complexion. For me, I'll be home, come sundown in the land where Actually, Grace, I'm free. Need to talk. Oh, Can't it wait? No. Matt and I've decided we don't want to be in the play. What? Be. Be but you're the leads, we need you. Be Not really bothered. Right? Toby Belch, right? So learn it on the fucking lines. Please. You can't do this. I need this play to work. I've got to get an A. It's really, really, really important. I'm just... I'm not feeling the love. From Minnie, Frankie or you. I think you're still fucked off at me for what I did. No! We're not. It's fine. Everybody's over it. We're all good. Listen. Come over mine tonight. Let me prove it. We'll do a girls' night in. It'll be just like old times. You'll feel the love. I promise. It'll be magic. Enter. Ah, Grace. What can I do for you? I was wondering if I could have some friends around. Out of the question. Why? Because education is war. Education is war against inefficiency, ignorance, idleness, and chewing gum. And our relationship must remain secret. But you're my dad, and you've got to meet my friends. That's what you do. They won't tell anyone, and Rich already knows. Dad, I want to have my friends around for tea, and that's that. Fine. But they must not breathe a word of what they see or hear. And Rich, I want him to come to dinner. Yes, I will meet him too. Oh, thanks, Dad. Thanks so much. You're going to love him. Grace, remember to stay. We must get A's. Hello, everyone. We've got two days till the exam and we're still not ready. So, can I have Minnie and Frankie up here to run through Act 1, Scene 5? Performing Shakespeare's more than reading words from a script, it's about catharsis. The outpouring of emotion you feel as the play finishes. A play is a promise to deliver that. And the only way to make sure that happens is to always remember the most important thing about Shakespeare that he knows more about you than you do. You've got to let his wisdom fill your soul. He makes us better people. That is your record of academic achievement. Plus, 
couple of other things. Your father's employment record, including the results of his last appraisal. It's not, as you can see, glowing. How did you get this? That's unimportant. I can tell from that information that your life, just like your father's, will add up to very little. Very little. Indeed. So what? I can make things easier for you. I can make them easier for your father. I know people. And I will not be a principal forever. What are you talking about? These drama examinations are externally moderated. I cannot influence the result. But if someone who I am told is very good on the stage were, say, to perform very badly on purpose... You want Grace to fail her examination? Why? Because, Richard, she is too good for you. Now, I trust that you will do what I ask. She's not for you, Richard. She's my little girl. See you tonight. Um, this is really good, Mrs. Blood. What do you call it again? Chicken. Yeah, of course, chicken. So are you enjoying performing Shakespeare, Richard? Uh, Rich is really good playing Aggie Cheek. Really funny. Reminds me of a young, not black, Sidney Poitier. Oh, uh, yeah. So, Richard, tell me, what did your father do? Richard's dad works in the civil service. Oh, really? How conscientious of him. Not really. Uh, Mum, could you please pass the peas? Of course, dear. <laughs> do you remember the pea song from that holiday in France and that silly waiter? We want some peas, we, we want, want some peas. peas. Please, 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 please give us some peas. We want some peas, we want some peas. Please, please, please give us some peas. We want some peas, we want some peas. Please, please, please give us some peas. We want some peas, we want some peas. Please, please, please give us some peas. Again and again. I really, really, really need a cigarette. You did really well. You see the way your dad was looking at me? That's just his way. He likes you, honestly. A very different, Grace. Well, maybe our parents are. No, I mean, you're different with them. You're not you. Grace! Your friends are here! <laughs> Woo! Girls' night in. Grace, I'll see you later, yeah? Ladies. So, you've met Mum. And now you can meet me. Professor Blood. Well, what are, you, what are you doing at Grace's house? Because her house is also my house. I am her father. I asked Grace to keep this a secret. And now I ask you all to keep it a secret too. Will you do that? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Remember, please, ladies. Have fun. I'm sorry I didn't tell you guys. He made me promise. Jesus Christ. What other secrets do you have, Grace? If that is even your real name. <laughs> cool bird. Are you the secret love child of Wayne Rooney and Susan Boyle? Hey, are you even a girl? Do you have a little winky, Grace? <laughs> Please don't hate me. Oh, don't worry about it. My sister's in prison. I don't exactly go around telling everyone about it. Anyway. Let's get fucked up. I bought you a present. What's that? 
It's cake. Want to try it? It'll be fun. Have you any idea how much this sounds like the beginning of an episode of Casualty? Liv, we should rehearse. Ugh, why bother? This will be much more fun. Grace is right. We're still not ready. Or at least some elements aren't. Really? And what elements would those be, Minnie? You know, this and that. OK, let's all do cocaine. <laughs> the reason I know that this will be awesome is you're all so much like your characters in the play. Yeah, 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 yeah. Liv, you're playing Olivia, right? She's beautiful, desired by all, but she's also really vulnerable. <laughs> <sighs> What's Frankie's story, then? I can do this one. Frankie is Viola, the girl dressed as a boy who can't get what she wants. Whatever that is. I know what I want. And what's that? What's what? Well, mm. Frankie, uh, you haven't really told us whether you're a, you know, or a... A what or a what? A lesbian. Liv, that's so... No, it's OK. I don't mind. And the answer is... No, I'm not anything. So you're bisexual? No, I'm into people. Who are you into at the moment? Well... Woo! I love this trick. Everyone dance. Dance with me. Oh, <laughs> 
one. I'll take you home. <laughs> You're heavy. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I'm not heavy. You're just small. Too small, yeah. <laughs> Shush, Rich. Yeah. Uh, I'm, I'm all right, Grace, cos I've got you to look after me. It's what you do. <laughs> Everyone's happy when Grace is around. You're a sh shape-shifter of happiness. <laughs> what are you talking about? You're not making any sense. I don't know who you are. You Grace Violet or Grace Blood? Are you Daddy's girl or my girl? Okay. I'm who I need to be, Rich. We all are. Haven't you heard the saying, all the world's a stage? Yeah, but it's not true, is it? I'm going home. Rich, tell me why you're unhappy. Hey, all the world's a stage, right? So none of this matters. It doesn't matter at all. That's not a happy face, Gracie. What's the matter, sweetheart? Basically, all my friends have fallen out, which means the play isn't going to work, which means I won't get an A for drama, which means Dad is going to send me back to Maybury's. I found this when I was cleaning your room. It's the one I used to read to you. Rapunzel was always your favourite. <laughs> but what's that... Rapunzel had to let down her hair so the prince could climb up. So what's that got to do with anything? It's got everything to do with everything, Grace. So what do I do? You get them on that stage no matter what. You are the director. Take control and be creative. Make a happy ending. How? Let down your hair, princess. Do not extort thy reasons from this clause. Oh. For that I woo. Therefore hast no clause. But rather reason thus than reason fetter. Love sought is good that given unsought is better. By innocence, I swear, and by my... Hold on. I've had an idea. Kiss her. Um, there's nothing about kissing in this script. You're meant to interpret Shakespeare. Try it. <clears throat> Um, but, uh, but, uh, rather reason thus than reason fetter. Love sought is good, but given unsought is better. Fine. Um, am I doing okay? You're doing fine. And thanks for covering for Liv. Thanks for the vote of confidence. You're doing your best, but we need Matty and Liv. After last night, I don't know if they're going to come back. They're our leads. Without them... We're fucked. Let's take an hour's break. Thanks, everyone. Sorry about last night. That's OK. You were just drunk. I know you didn't mean what you said. No, I'm sorry about being drunk, but I meant what I said. What I can remember. What? All that stuff about me being fake, you meant it? No, not fake. I'm just saying you're always performing. You're an actress, not a director. You're always playing the part of whoever the person you're with needs you to be. So, fake then? Well, you always say that you're made of stories. And you are. I don't understand what's wrong with that. What's really going on, Rich? Nothing. Nothing. Come on, say it. Say what you're thinking. 
I don't know what we are. I don't know if we're right. I know what's going on. You've met my parents and now you're freaking out. Yeah, I am actually, yeah. Don't be such a girl. It's not like we're getting married. It was one dinner. Yeah, one mental dinner. So, shall we just not bother then? Just screw all this? No! I don't know, Grace. I just, I don't know what to do about us. Go away, Rich. Go away now. Fine. Not bad, eh? This used to be a sports hall. Great acoustics, though. Ave Maria! Wanna try it out? Oh, no. It's brand new, it needs christening. Say some likes. Get a feel for it. To be or not to be? Louder. Project. Fill the space. To be or not to be? That is the question. Whether it is noble in the mind to suffer the slings and arrows of outrageous fortune, or to take arms against a sea of troubles and by opposing end them, to die, to sleep, no more. No. No. No fucking way. No fucking way. Grace? Absolutely fine. You're back in the play. Don't argue. You're going to come and rehearse right now. Fine. Is Liv here? Can you see Liv? Where is she? Haven't seen her since last night. She went out to my calls, messenger, emails, nothing. Have you broken up? She's not talking to me. I don't think she trusts me. What sort of boyfriend are you? A bad one. Okay, but I... But I love her, Grace. I really fucking love her. Come on, we need to rehearse. Your master quits you, and for your service done him so much against the metal of your sex. Since you've served me for so long, here's my hand. Shall from this time be your master's mistress. Through her window, a single note that stays with me. A single note that stays with me. Matty, Frankie, you need to work on that kiss. With me. But that's it for today, everyone. <laughs> Better learn the rest of Liv's part. I'll be fine. Get you to your lord! I cannot love him! Let him send no more. Unless, perchance, you come to me again. Going on, sweetheart. Tell Mummy, and she'll make it better. I can't make it work. I can't make a happy ending. Why don't you imagine the look on your dad's face when it does work? That's a reason to try. I'm trying so hard already. Then try harder, darling. I'd find you here. You have to come back. What for? For Matty, for Minnie, for Frankie, for me, for everything. 
What's the point? Me and Matty, me and Minnie, me and Frankie, it's all fucked, Grace. I don't know how to be with them anymore. Yes, you do. I know you do. Just be with them. What do you think of me, Grace? What I did with Nick, with Minnie, what do you think? I think everything is going to be fine. Everyone is going to get what they want. I promise you, I know it. How do you know that? Because it's the only thing I believe in. Because it's the only thing I've got left to count on. Everyone, I know it's been a difficult morning with all the last minute changes I've made. I want to thank you all for everything you've put into this. I know it's been hard for everyone, but we're ready. So, let's show those motherfuckers how this story ends. <laughs> Positions, everyone. We need to talk. After. Okay. Ooh. I'm nervous. I'm nervous. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. Rich, mate, I'm absolutely shitting myself. But rather reason thus, with reason better. Love sought is good, but given unsought is better. By innocence, I swear, and by my youth, I have one heart, one bosom, and one truth, and that no woman has, nor never none shall mistress be of it, save I alone. And so adieu, good madam. Never more shall I my master's tears to you deplore. Yet come again, for thou perhaps mayst move that heart, which now abhors to like his love. No, Faith, I'll not stay a jot longer. Thy reason, dear Venom, give thy reason. You must needs yield your reason, Sir Andrew. <coughs> Mary, I saw your niece do more favours to the house, sir. <laughs> <laughs> she bestowed on you. You're a sick bastard, do you know that? What do you mean? She fucking turned you on. Me and her, it turned you on. Have you any idea how weird that is? You were kissing another girl, of course it turned me on. Guys, shh. Play. Do you love her? What's going on? I love you. But do you love her? I'm sure you'll be very happy together. Whatever's going on, you can't go now. You can't leave me. You told me. It would all be okay. It will be, it will. We just have to finish. We just have to finish the play. You forget her now, okay? You're on in two. Come on. We need to finish. Just to finish. Now, have 
heaven walks on earth. Three months hath this youth tended upon me, but more of that anon. Take him as aside. What do you say, Cesario? Good, my lord? If it ought to be to the old tune, my lord, it is as fat and fulsome to mine ear as howling after music. A long while ago the world began with a hoe, the wind and the rain. But all is done, the play is won, and we'll strive to please you again every day. I have decided that you will be returning to Maybury's after all. What? What? Fuck! Have some decorum, young lady. You are not in Scotland. I did what you asked. I did everything. I worked so hard. Mum, say something. We wanted you to finish your school year in a good place. Thanks so much. That makes it all fine. The deal it was never a deal, was it? You are always going to send me back. I am doing this because I love you. I just want better for you. No, David. You just want a different daughter. Grace? Grace? I'm going away, Rich. For good. What about us? You were right, Rich. You were totally right. I'm not real. Yes, you are. You're real to me. I was a twat for saying that I... I'm a story. A character. A fucking fiction. But you're not. The others aren't. My parents aren't. And I don't belong here. Where are you going? To a fucking castle in the clouds. Some supper. How good it goes. This is what you call mercy. It kills me to see you like this, Grace. Everything will work out okay. You know, you've spent my whole life filling me with stories. Things that aren't true were never true. You told me everything was going to be okay as long as I tried. All these stories, all these lies I believed. <laughs> Great expectations. Lies. Sense and sensibility. Lies. I believed it all and now I'm miserable and it's your fault. And you can't fix it.
those would sing. If it were not night. But soft, what light from yonder window breaks? It is the east, and Julia is the sun. See how she leans her cheek upon her hand. Oh, that I were a glove upon that hand, that I might touch that cheek. Rich, what are you doing? Oh, she speaks. Speak again, bright angel. Be careful. For thou art as glorious to this night. Being me, <laughs> as is a winged messenger of heaven. My lady, oh, it is my love. Oh, that she knew she were. Be quiet, my parents are here. Oh. Oh. Oh, alack. There lies more peril in thine eyes than twenty of their swords. You're very sweet, but this can't happen, Rich. There's nothing we can do, it's over. Oh, wouldst thou leave me so unsatisfied? Tell me. Tell me what to do, what's left to do. The exchange of thy love's faithful vow for mine. What do people in Shakespeare plays do when it's all fucked, when they're trapped? How do they work it all out? Maybe stories are just stories. Or maybe... can make our life a story. So marry me, grace of violet blood. <laughs> I wonder, how many goodly creatures are they? How beauteous mankind is. A brave new world. That has such people in it.